During this brief overview, you'll see how we repaired the planar boxes at the SunTrust building in Pelican Bay, Naples, Florida. This is just one portion of the overall restoration we performed to the SunTrust building after Hurricane Wilma passed through in 2005. Our challenge is to provide long-term protection from water intrusion at the failing planter boxes on multiple floors. The first step, of course, would be to remove the plantings and soil in all the boxes. We then scrape the interior of the boxes clean. And as you can see here, the failing areas that allowed for water intrusion, causing much interior damage. These planter boxes were not properly waterproof during new construction and the drain assemblies were severely corroded. Depending on the project, we utilize a couple different waterproofing products for planter boxes. Here we're using Kemper System products called Kemperol V210, which is a monolithic membrane created in the field by combining the cold applied liquid polyester resin with the polyester reinforcing fleece. This mixture is similar to what we use on roofs and elevated decks. All Kemper System membranes are built with high quality, high strength polyester fleece, which dictates the thickness of the membrane and provides the key to its versatility, durability, and adhesion. Kemper products are unaffected by standing water and are root and rot resistant, perfect for planter boxes. Most competitors' products use a random glass fiber reinforcement or none at all. With Kemper's 50 years of fleece technology and the 1 billion square feet of application, they've proven its ability to stand the test of time. The system is slightly more expensive than other waterproofing membranes as their technology is far more advanced. And you get what you pay for, proven protection with sufficient warranties by us and the manufacturer. There are three main steps to this assembly consisting of preparation and cleaning of the substrate, the application of the primer, then the fleece membrane, and finally, the application of the surfacing material. The process of preparing the surface is meticulous and includes extensive cleaning, any repairs that are needed to the surface, and the sealing of all transitions or corners, and also the penetrations, in this case, the drain assemblies. We then apply a quick drying camper primer to fill in any minor gaps and to ensure proper adhesion of the membrane layer. Our next step is mixing the Kemper resin, which we brush evenly onto the surface. Then we unroll the Kemper fleece material, avoiding any folds or wrinkles, and we work the fleece into the resin, saturating from the bottom up. We use an adequate number of skilled workmen who are thoroughly trained and experienced in this craft and completely familiar with the specified requirements and methods needed for optimum performance. We follow all product manufacturers' recommendations and specifications. And we always designate a single individual as project foreman who is on site at all times during installation. Usually Ed Clark, who is our senior waterproofing mechanic, who's been with us for almost 20 years. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't hesitate to call us here at the Aerial Companies for your restoration needs.